Alita, Battle Angel 185, The Midnight Betrayal. Character list. Alita Rosa Salazar, Doc Ito, Christoph Waltz, Hugo Kian Johnson, Nano, Chicha Amatayakul, Anana Komatsu, Hoot, Cybernetic Owl, Echo, Cybernetic Fox, Scene 1, The Uneasy Calm. The city is wrapped in an eerie quiet after the chaos of the last battle. Iron City's streets are nearly empty, the tension in the air thick and suffocating. Hoot perches high on a derelict building, his cybernetic eyes scanning the deserted roads below while Echo silently slinks between alleyways, ensuring no threats lurk in the shadows. Alita leans against a rusted rail, her eyes on the distant skyline. Arika stands beside her, cigarette in hand, and Nano is seated on a low wall, her telekinetic senses scanning for trouble. We've got a break for now, but it won't last, Alita says, her voice laced with caution. Arika exhales smoke and shrugs. It never does. Nano, still deep in thought, glances toward Alita. I don't like it. Something feels off. The warlord's forces didn't retreat. They vanished. Alita frowns. You're right. It's too quiet. Scene 2. The Missing Patrol. Doc Ido joins them, his expression grim. We've lost contact with the patrol guarding the East Sector. I sent Hoot and Echo to check it out, but they're not picking up anything. No signs of life. Alita's eyes narrow. That's where the warlord's army disappeared. We need to move. Now. Arika flicks her cigarette away, her hand instinctively resting on her katana's hilt. I'm ready to carve someone up. Nano stands, her expression serious. I'm sensing something. It's not just the warlord's forces. There's someone else behind this. Alita nods. Then let's find out who. Scene 3. The ambush. The team moves swiftly through the streets, tension tightening their every step. Echo leads the way, the clicking of its mechanical limbs, the only sound in the oppressive silence. As they near the East Sector, Alita suddenly raises her hand, signaling them to stop. I feel it too, Nano whispers. We're being watched. Arika, cigarette now hanging loosely from her lips, mutters under her breath, Let them come. Suddenly, the streetlights flicker and die, plunging the area into darkness. Alita draws her Damascus blade just as a group of cybernetic soldiers leaps from the shadows, their eyes glowing a menacing red. Arika grins wickedly. Finally. She charges forward, katana flashing as she cuts through the enemy ranks. Alita moves beside her, slashing with precision, while Nano uses her psychic abilities to throw the soldiers against walls, tearing them apart with telekinetic force. Scene 4. The True Enemy Revealed As the last of the soldiers fall, the ground beneath them trembles. A massive figure emerges from the darkness, an armored cyborg with glowing blue eyes. It's not the warlord, but something far more dangerous. I've been waiting for this, the cyborg growls, his voice deep and mechanical. The warlord was only the beginning. I will finish what he started. Alita steps forward, her blade ready. Who are you? The cyborg's eyes flash. I am the Midnight Warlord, the true leader of the uprising. Arika spits out her cigarette, eyes blazing with anger. You're just another target. But before they can attack, the Midnight Warlord lifts a massive arm, releasing a shockwave that knocks them off their feet. Alita crashes into a nearby building, Arika rolls across the ground, and Nano is thrown against the wall. Scene 5. Nano's Desperation Nano struggles to her feet, blood trickling down her face. She extends her hand, her telekinetic energy crackling around her as she tries to subdue the Midnight Warlord. But his power is overwhelming, and he pushes back with ease, sending her crashing to the ground once more. Nano! Arika yells, scrambling to her side. Nano's eyes glow fiercely, but there's fear in them. He's too strong. Arika pulls her up, her voice soft but firm. We'll take him down, together. Scene 6. Alita's Reckoning. Alita rises from the debris, shaking off the shock. She locks eyes with the Midnight Warlord, her grip tightening on her blade. With a roar, she charges, her Damascus blade glowing as it slices through the air toward the cyborg. The Midnight Warlord blocks with his armored arm, sparks flying as the two clash. Alita's attacks are relentless, but the Warlord's defense is impenetrable. You fight well, the Warlord sneers, but you are no match for me. Alita's eyes blaze with determination. We'll see about that. Arika's Fury As Alita battles the Warlord, Arika and Nano work together to flank him. Arika's katana cuts deep into the cyborg's armor, and Nano uses her telekinesis to weaken his joints. 
But every time they land a hit, the Midnight Warlord retaliates with brutal force, his power growing with every blow. You can't win, he taunts, swinging his massive arm toward Arika. Arika dodges, barely avoiding the strike and smirks. Wanna bet? She spins around and slashes at his exposed side, sparks flying as her blade connects. Scene 8. The Betrayal Just as the team begins to gain the upper hand, an explosion rocks the battlefield. A figure emerges from the smoke, Hugo. Hugo? Alita's voice wavers in disbelief. Hugo steps forward, his expression cold. I didn't want it to come to this, Alita, but Iron City has to fall. It's the only way. Alita's heart sinks as she stares at him, the truth dawning on her. You. You're with him? Hugo's eyes darken. I'm sorry. Erica spits blood, glaring at Hugo. You traitorous son of a... Alita cuts her off, her voice trembling with fury. How could you? Hugo's expression hardens. It's for the greater good. Scene 9. A Deadly Decision With Hugo's betrayal, the Midnight Warlord gains the upper hand once more. Alita, heartbroken and enraged, fights with everything she has, but the Warlord's power continues to grow, fueled by Hugo's treachery. We need to retreat, Nano says breathlessly, blood dripping down her temple. Arika shakes her head, lighting another cigarette. No way in hell. Alita, torn between love and rage, locks eyes with Hugo one final time. This isn't over. Hugo's face remains stoic as he turns away, joining the Midnight Warlord. It never is. Scene 10. The Escape. With no other choice, the team retreats, battered and broken. As they vanish into the shadows, Iron City's fate hangs in the balance. The Midnight Warlord and Hugo stand victorious. For now. Alita, her heart heavy with betrayal, knows that their greatest battle lies ahead. Ah, to be continued.